Yearling time is a key time for collecting performance data on beef cattle operations. This should start with individual animal identification. A number of different identification methods are available to beef cattle producers. A contemporary group is a group of animals of the same age, sex, breed, and management group with data collected at the same point in time. For data collection to be valid, it must take place during specified age windows for the animals. Individual animal weights are an essential yearling performance measure for both yearling bulls and heifers. With proper contemporary grouping, this information can later be used to rank individual animals by their adjusted weights. It can also be used to assess the herd nutritional program. Animal temperament can be evaluated during animal handling. Very excitable animals may be candidates for culling, as these animals may pose a danger to other animals and also the safety of their handlers. As well, there can be performance issues related to animal temperament. Yearling hip height is a vertical measurement taken to evaluate the frame size of an animal. To ensure an accurate measurement, be sure that the animal is standing on a level surface and that the measurement is taken directly across the hips. Scrotal circumference is a yearling bull measurement used in national cattle evaluations. It is also a key component of breeding soundness examinations. When taking the measurement, be sure to measure the two testes at their widest part. Also, make sure the instrument is secured snugly for an accurate measurement. Pelvic area may be measured and used as a culling criterion for yearling heifers. Heifers with extremely small pelvic size may be culled to lessen the risk of calving difficulty in the herd. Reproductive tract scores are a measurement that can be determined through rectal palpation of uterine horns and ovaries to determine the physiological readiness of heifers for breeding. Ultrasound body composition scanning may be done in yearling bulls and heifers to determine body composition of live animals. A certified technician is needed to perform this service. The images collected are then sent to a certified laboratory for interpretation. Data collected from ultrasound body composition scanning include ribeye area, rib fat, rump fat, and intramuscular fat or marbling. For records collected during yearling data collection measurement time to be meaningful, they should be organized, complete, accurate, relevant, and timely. It also helps for everyone involved in record keeping for the operation to be able to easily interpret the records. Data is only helpful if it is used in decision making. Therefore, it is important to report information to breed associations in a timely manner and to use that information to make operational decisions.